Most stock markets in Asia have bounced back after last week's huge sell-off. Analysts say state-owned financial institutions engaged in a buying spree that left China's Shanghai index up 3.7 percent. One expert says only the government could boost the market that high from a 3.4 percent loss earlier in the day. In Hong Kong, the Hang Seng lost 7 percent on Friday but soared on Monday, closing up nearly 10 percent. Australia's S&P closed up almost 5 percent after a record-breaking 8 percent plunge on Friday. That's got investors a little hopeful. Uh, we've just watched our uh, self-managed fund sort of go down and down and down, so we're hoping that this is the bottom of the market. In Singapore, the benchmarks gained 5 percent. In South Korea, the gains were more than 3 percent. But in Shanghai, Taiwan and Indonesia, Monday was another day of lower numbers, with benchmarks losing more than 3 percent. Trading was closed in Japan because of a holiday. Wall Street futures indicate a sharp rebound is in store ahead of the opening bell on Monday. Or Larisi Associated Press.